formalities. And our live game is Senegal against Cameroon. I'm Peter Drury and this is Jim Beglin. Hi Peter, always good to work with you. I'm really looking forward to this now. So it's away we go then. Looks to slip it through. They'll try as they might, they just couldn't get into an attacking area. Tries to get it forward quickly. A mixture of good defending and indecisive passing. No progress. Tries a through ball. Cut out in the nick of time. Defence has got rid of that. Over hits and out of play. Now here's the through ball. They've managed to get it away. Well, we don't even need to look at the stats, do we, Peter? Zero attempts, zero goals, and uh, excitement, forget it. And that's put paid to a promising move. Looks to dink one in. Now here's the through ball. Shot at goal! It's in! With time and space aplenty, he was never going to miss. I just think it's clever positioning from clever movement, and when all of that is synchronised with the right pass, that's what happens. Senegal break the deadlock. Still a fragile lead though, they can't afford to sit on this. Tries to dink it in. Goalkeeper's ball. Looks like a good ball through. Just the goalkeeper to beat. And he's on his way. So they got the only goal to give them a 1-0 lead. Senegal are in control here on the brink of half-time. And the flag has stayed down. Well, we were unlikely to see a goal then because there were so many players crowding out that danger area. I think something very special was going to be needed. Looks to thread it through. Plays a clever pass. First 45 minutes are up. Well, you obviously have to give credit to the front men for the half-time lead, but I think the midfield can really pat themselves on the back too. They work tirelessly for me. Senegal head for the dressing room in possession of a 1-0 lead. Well, 1-0 may be good enough, so they may err on the side of caution and, and get more players behind the ball instead of running beyond it. They could even try to, to spoil it from here, we'll see. Pumps it upfield. <laughs> this 
this defence just doesn't trust itself to, to play a higher line. Frightened of people getting in behind. Yeah, absolutely. It's in! And with that goal comes comfort! What a clean hit. No one gets in the way of that. That is just the top drawer finish. He was always in control and couldn't have placed it any better. Senegal take a two-goal lead and things should be comfortable from here on in. Well, at 1-0 this contest was still nicely poised, but now that it's gone to two, mindsets are affected a lot more. Winning belief one way and that losing feeling the other. Goes long. Now here's the through ball. Played it out wide, but the less said about that pass, the better. Just about up to 75 minutes. Passes it through. Now the pass. He comes flying in! No, oh, not the best of headers. He was right in front of goal and he probably should have scored to be fair. Senegal have time on their side now, as well as a two-goal lead. It is just about done. Sticks in a foot to win it back. Into the channel. Keeps everyone guessing. Defending was physical, no nonsense, and it had to be. And that's that. Well, the manager heads down the tunnel, sways.